Tastes like candy, candy. This is Mike Diamond and you are watching Homework. This is Miss Matenga. Our special guests today are couture designer Nick Stryker, gorgeous young boy, and also Miss Candy, style icon who also pulls the lottery numbers on Spanish television. Welcome, Miss Candy. Alamundo. <laughs> yes, girl. Yolanda Vega ain't got nothing on you, girl. <laughs> she does. Oh, she she does. looking fat today. Mm -hmm. Thank you, sweeties. And today we are doing some viewer questions from the audience. Wait. I can't wait. Okay, so. Oh, I'm excited. Dear Homework, perhaps you could elaborate on your recipe for getting a man. I'm an old queen and there's no way on earth I'm going to get away with butching it up. These wrists are never going to stop flapping and addressing everyone as my dear is never going to stop either. Do I compensate by acting really stupid or feeble-minded or would I just look pathetic? This anxious old thing needs to know. Wow, I love that question. Mm. What do we think? I love that question. Mama. Did you write this really question? <laughs> no, well, I didn't. First of all, Candy's gorgeous and probably has no problem. <laughs> but she is a little someone. feeble. Nick no. is gorgeous, young, and talented, so I'm not sure you I have real that question, trouble. But... <laughs> what, 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 what should we tell this queen? What should she do? <laughs> Jump out the window. Jump out the window, you old bitch. <laughs> I think, I think there's, I actually think that, you know, we're all going to get older if we're lucky, and I also think that, um, Th that question is coming from a place of insecurity. Yes. Like you can feel like it. Like that scarf around yeah. your neck. And so, well, it's to cover the neck. Um, but uh, but I, I think what is sexy is confidence uh, and, and being secure in yourself. And there's going to be all different types of gay guys out there. Mm -hmm. Young, old, fit, not, gorgeous, average. Fierce. Ratchet. Fierce, fierce ratchet. And the right. thing is, is if you're older, don't walk out only looking for sex or love. Sure. Walk out there to enjoy life. Oh, you know what I mean? I, I think that, that I think you gotta yeah. enjoy life. Emotional intelligence and positivity also is very uh, attractive. Yeah. Like yeah. just yeah. understanding totally. really how, not necessarily how you're coming across to people, but being grateful for your surroundings, for the people that you're sharing this moment with, right. and and letting them in in that instance, you know, expressing mm -hmm. to them how happy you are to Absolutely. share that with them. Exactly. It's important to do so because sometimes they're not aware. Can exactly. you agree with that? What you think? I do. I agree with it. I think that if you give. If you give that the the secure feeling, you show that you're not confident. Confidence, a man, a man. confidence yeah, is sexy. I also do want to say. Get back. I also and do. And they want, will notice you. And they will notice you. <laughs> By the way, also, <laughs> your hair is is doing all kinds of fabulous it's things. Lay, oh, that hair is How do you lay, get that like yeah. layer cake souffle yeah. action? I flip it yeah. over. Yeah. Comb it with a rake. Oh. And right, then I flick my hat back, girl, and it's just sitting. So listen, viewer, what you gotta do is flip your head down, yeah. comb it with a rake, right. and flip it but back, I, I do, and it's all good. I wanna say one last thing, though, that if you are, like, in your late 60s, and maybe not the most beautiful thing in the whole world, and you, you know, and, you know, <laughs> and maybe not the most beautiful thing in the world, and you only want to sleep with someone who's 25 and really muscular and really beautiful. Hell, I didn't get the checkbook. Right, then you better have money because if someone who's 25 and really muscular and beautiful worked really hard to get there, and that's probably what they're looking for as well. Mm -hmm. So I'm not saying to settle, never settle, but also take a genuine look at who you are and be open to the possibilities of maybe dating people your own age. And mm -hmm. you know, you have to be realistic, not not you know, not down on yourself, but you have to sort of play the field that you are in. And you, know, you have to have a colorful scarf. Yes. Believe it or not, there's a second part to this question. Oh no. From this queen. She say I was at the baths recently and having sex with a younger man. Honey, these days they're all younger. Sigh. <laughs> he got down to blow me, saw my white pubic hairs, cried snowballs, and started laughing. <laughs> Should I resort to Grecian formula or just brazen it out? Well, well, what do we think of that? You're hooking up with like 20 something year olds at the fucking bathhouse. Like, exactly. <laughs> I'm surprised. That really? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I mean, no. if, if you're, if you're self conscious about it, take care of it. It's that simple. Like, yeah. if you're going to sit there and complain Can about it, then I'm sorry. Me? You're Can with you them. Man. Shave them. You shave them. I think you'd rather just shave them. Really shave because them? Because if they're that long, then corn roll them. 
Oh, hello. Although, Maybe. like, when you're Thank really you. old and you shave the pubes, sometimes, like, your junk, like, like, looks like... Have you ever seen, like, those old little potato women? Oh. You know those old potato uh, things that they, people make? And it just looks like... What they yeah. do have, like, a scrotum lift. lift. When it grows back. They can get a scrotum lift. A scrotum lift? A scrotum lift. You can get a scrotum lift? Yes, to lift up those testicles that are very long. Oh. Really? And make it look like younger junk. You know? I like I like testicles that are so big that you could like make them like curbangers. Remember curbangers? Oh, like, like, like you would go like this. Yeah, and I just yeah. want to. Yeah. Mm, mm, mm. I just hate when I get that. my nuts caught in my flip flops, girl. When I'm walking on the beach. <laughs> yeah, you step on your own balls. That's yes. not cute. That's it's when you get old, cute. girl. Why do you think you go to wear skirts? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> just let them breathe. So, yeah, you can. Oh, sh- so you can, can, you can dye your pubes. <laughs> yes, you can. Is there a special dye for that? I know you've yes, been a beautician. Just for men. Candy. Just for men? <laughs> just for pubes. Just for pubes. Is there a special pubic uh, Permanent marker. Dye? <laughs> permanent marker. <laughs> Sharpie. I, called, Sharpie. Uh, I think it's called Betty. Betty. Yeah, Betty. It comes Betty. different colors. Are you serious? Yes. Wait, really? Come Girls serve up some Betty on them pubes. I'm not Betty my pubes <laughs> today. Yeah. 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 Shoes. Yeah. 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 Snowballs. I don't know, bleach it. Or them. Red, pink, blue, yellow. That's pink. kind of there's like that Delson blue stuff that you get get rid of the yellow yeah. and like you, you actually bring yeah. out the platinum or the white. Yeah, you know, but then it's a gray. But then sometimes it can turn time. little turn little old lady blue and yeah. it makes you look older. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Well, well it sounds like this old lady blue somebody. Or, or how about, how about <laughs> go go tanning? I mean, don't leatherize. I mean, don't don't like don't <laughs> actually tan that high. But I mean, like go tanning and maybe get a little color, and that might yeah. that might offer yeah. a little bit of you, decent contrast. You can also as well. get a merkin, a pubic wig. Oh, a merkin is a merkin. pubic yeah. wig. So or again, honey, they you just exist. be salt and pepper you down do. below. Mm-hmm. Salt and pepper, push it real good. So our advice to you, old queen, <laughs> be who you are. Yeah. Live your life. Life. Snowball, don't snowball. Cornrows. Don't cornrows. <laughs> whatever it takes. And by the way, snowballs. You need to be more confident. Maybe he yeah. meant snow caps. Like the candy. Which is oh, like so good, with the good. little white dots yeah. on it. No, snow, snow caps is when your dog eats a poo out of the litter basket. Yes, that's, that's snow true. caps. What are goobers? Candy? <laughs> Me. Okay, this I'll is my time. <laughs> This is Miss Matinga. We'd like to thank our special guest today, fashion designer Nick Stryker, style icon and lottery number ball puller Miss Candy. You've been learned. <laughs>